went to see Ford for one reason, and that's because I care about you. Yeah, but you're not my mother, Star. No, but I'm your friend, and if something was to hurt you and I didn't try to stop it... Yeah, but okay, to stop Ford from seeing me? That's, like, so high school. You, like, are in high school. And Ford teaches college. Shouldn't he know better? Look, I just wanted to know if he cares about you. Why? I didn't go ask Mr. Joplin if he cared about you. Mr. Joplin wasn't having sex with me. And he knew that I was too crazy and too young to even know what the hell I was doing. Oh, so, so you think that I'm just some clueless kid that can't make my own decisions? I can't stop thinking about Gigi. I mean, I held a gun on her, Taya. She's gonna have nightmares about me for the rest of her life. Gigi's pretty tough. She survived a lot. Yeah, okay, fine. She's got one more bad thing she has to get over. And what about, what about Sierra? Is she gonna be okay? I'm sure Oliver and Kyle are taking very good care of her. You need to stop worrying about everyone else and start focusing on yourself. You're the one being arraigned today. Yeah, I don't know why you're wasting your time. Because everyone is entitled to a defense, Skylar. You need someone in your corner and that person is me. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I kind of thought it might be Roxy too, but... Um... What did she say she was coming today? No, something like that, but I guess she came to her senses and took my advice. What advice did you give her? I told her to forget I'm her son. Well, this is insane. Instead of Mitch Lawrence being my father, he's Skyler's. Yeah, well, I couldn't believe it either. That's why I did the DNA thing. But it's true. I don't understand. How did this happen again? After I had my baby, we realized how bad off it was, and we knew that we had to do something. So Allison took me to this hospital, where her sister was a doctor, Leah Joplin. Leah Joplin? Yeah, then Allison panicked, because she thought my baby was going to die. So she grabbed you from one of the nurses, and she gave you to me. And she told me that you were mine. And then when she found out that my real kid was going to live, it was too late to make the switch. Mitch would have been suspicious. Yeah. So Allison made sure that I kept you and that her sister kept the other kid. She gave away your baby and never told you. Listen, um, I got to go because Skylar's arraignment is in. Oh, you're going to court? Yeah, well, someone's got to stand by him. Why shouldn't it be his mother? I know that you were probably expecting something like this, but there's one thing that may surprise you. About Kim? Yeah. Uh, I didn't catch her at anything, and she came clean all by herself. And I don't think Kim would admit to cheating on me if she were only after my money. Well, I guess that's, that's something, Dad. Look, if I, if I was hard on Kim, I'm sorry. It was only because I didn't want to see you get hurt. Well, the hell with me. I can take whatever I have to. So long as, at the end of the day, I still have my brother. Remember when I found out I couldn't walk? I really lost it. Threw stuff. Yelled. But you let me. You knew what I needed more than I did. I never thanked you. Instead, I made you the bad guy. I blamed you and Mom for not letting me have that surgery. I need to make that up to you, Dad. I really need to. Just please. Just please give me that chance. she was, she'd be out of luck. I only have eyes for you. Oh, aren't you sweet? That's never stopped Kelly from making a fool out of herself. I mean, anybody who would volunteer to work for Todd Manning obviously has man issues. Blair, <laughs> hmm? there's an old saying about a pot and a kettle. Maybe you heard of it. You are so clever. You know what, let me get that. Hey. Teresa? Oh, Todd. 
Elijah is making breakfast for us, and you're obviously here to see Kelly. As a matter of fact, I am. Well, I think you might be more comfortable, the two of you, maybe conducting business over at the Sun. Don't it's you think? It's not business. This is personal. House and Perkins said that Mitch Lawrence sent her to okay. kill Melinda, but Melinda was already dead when she got there. Does Kelly believe that? No, she doesn't know what to believe. Right now, she just wants someone who's making these calls telling her her mom was murdered. How many calls have there been? Two, so far. And both came from inside the facility where her mom was living. Out in California? Yeah. Well, it sounds like you have a plane to catch. You're kidding me. No, I'm not. <laughs> we, we, we just found out you're a high-risk pregnancy. That means I need to keep an eye on you and an eye on you. Yeah, well, we are going to be just fine. Mm -hmm. I, I, I know you're going to be just fine. You know why? Because I'm not going anywhere. Yeah, no, 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 see, 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 that's the last thing that I want. 